Absolutely, you know, everyone knows my uh, my unfortunate incident when I first made my debut for the club. Um, and, you know, although I would have liked to have a more successful time on the pitch, uh, I would say, first and foremost, I thank God that, um, you know, I've improved as a person a lot. I've, uh, I've grown as a person, I've matured a lot as a person. And um, uh, I'm very thankful for that. And, as a footballer, I have uh, no doubt that um, despite uh, what I've been through, that I'm a much better player now than I was two and a half years ago before I joined the club. And uh, right now I'm fit and healthy and um, full of confidence and, and really uh, am thankful for, for, the, for the medical staff and, and the coaching staff getting me to a position where um, physically I, I, feel, I feel great, mentally I'm in a great place. And, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to what the future future has in store for me. Yeah, absolutely. There's a saying um, that, that God gives his toughest battles to his strongest soldiers. So, um, you know, I look at my past very positively. Um, and not only as a player, but as a man, it's uh, helped me mature a lot. Um, and to be honest, I'm, I'm better off for it now that I've been through it. Um, and absolutely say that, uh, and I've got to thank the medical staff and, and the team here at the club, everyone, everyone, everyone's been very supportive from the players, the coaching staff, the medical staff have worked with me tirelessly, um, and, and the fans, um, so, but I, I definitely look forward to the future now and like it was preparing me for something, so, um, Definitely looking forward to the future and what it holds and, and I'm very positive about it and, and like you said, going through that gives you confidence that um, no matter what comes your way, you know, you'll deal with it and, and uh, be better off for it.